Nigeria, among other nations of the world, continues to battle with the reality of COVID-19. Just like other nations, lockdown seems to be the only known measure to curtail the spread of the virus. It is day eight into the lockdown, and Plus TV Africa correspondent Amaka Okoye visits Ogogoro community, a river Rhine community on the island of Lagos, to find out what the reality is. Her report. We set out to Ogogoro community to find out how the lockdown as a result of coronavirus is affecting this river Rhine community. Our first stop, a visit to the ballet of the community. And right into it, he shares their reality. Now since ever when they shut this thing down, we not see nobody but our shaman, Rashida, and she bring small food, come give us for here. But for state, we never see anything. Everybody is hungry. Nobody go out, nobody coming. We sit there for the hungry like this. And nobody fit talk to whether they the chop or not, you know, they, we just suffer. See my people them now. We're not there like this before. And in further conversation, it turned out that their concerns are not only coronavirus related. In this village, more than 300. But no school. We try to carry them go other places, go school, very far. When election time come now, ah, tomorrow we will bring this eco. Tomorrow we will bring and come. Nothing. We not see anything. Corona don't come now. Hungry won't kill all the children. Self. No. no hospital. Nothing. Nothing. If we sick here now, if now middle night, we go try to rush go Lagos. We don't get market for here. We they go buy small for Lagos. Come they sell small small provision all those things. We they go market. They go buy come sell. As we say, since when this thing happened, we know they go. No, they go market because people where you go, they beat there. This community of over 80 years old is also a home for people from all parts of Nigeria and beyond. And when asked if any form of financial assistance was received from the state government as palliatives, Mary Akoto says. We don't see anything, we don't see money, we don't see anything. As we say, people know they come out, they are hungry, they are everywhere. No food. Locking somebody down for the past, going to a week plus now. The major business they are doing here is fishing. And even the fishing, we have stopped fishing because a lot of people can't go to water because of the lockdown. So we are pleading for the government to come and assist us here in this community. And what about the fear of coronavirus? They pray to God. They make it not come this place. They pray to God. And we leave Ogogoro community, not with the answers, but bearing the hope of the people for a better life. For Plus TV Africa, Amaka Okoye.